praise the lord my dear brothers and sisters in the name of our lord and savior jesus christ today i would like to share some thoughts with you and the topic i want to share is prayer prayer means talking or interacting or communicating with god prayer can be spoken silent or a song it can be used to praise god or to ask for something including help and forgiveness in philippians chapter 4 verse 19 the bible says my god shall supply all your need according to his riches in glory by christ jesus god knows our needs and he is able to give whatever we ask in prayer our prayer should be faithful and liked by god don't worry about anything instead pray about everything in matthew chapter 6 verse 6 the bible says when thou prayers enter into thy closes and when thou has shut thy door pray to thy father which is in secret and thy father which seeth in secret shall reward thee openly you may get a doubt that whose prayer god will listen good or bad rich or poor no matter whoever you are all are equal in the sight of the god definitely god will listen your prayer the prayer of righteous man is powerful and effective in bible word of god says that Whatever we ask in prayer believe that you have received it you must wait patiently after asking god be joyful in hope patient in affliction faithful in prayer pray in the spirit god says that call upon me and come and pray to me and i will hear you in philippians chapter 4 verse 7 be careful for nothing but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your requests be made known unto god heavenly father knows that we have need of all these things seek first the kingdom of god and his righteousness and all the things be added unto you rejoice always pray continually pray without ceasing give thanks in all circumstances for this is god's will for you in christ jesus we must always read watch listen meditate and pray there are four types of prayer in the bible prayer of adoration prayer of contrition prayer of petition and prayer of thanksgiving prayer of adoration means praising god prayer of contrition is asking for god's forgiveness prayer of petition means asking god for a favor prayer of thanksgiving is showing god's gratitude let us see the first man of prayer in the bible is abraham the first notable prayer whose text is recorded in the torah and hebrews bible occurs when abraham pleads with god not to destroy the people of sodom where his nephew lot resides where and how can we pray you can either pray your prayers in your mind or speak them out loud god is able to hear your prayers either way before a word is on my tongue you lord know it completely that is that god is speaking to you How can we be strong in prayer? First, know to whom you are speaking, and secondly, thank him. Next, ask for God's help. Fourthly, say about what you need. Finally, ask for forgiveness. So, you must be a man of prayer. You must have the habit of praying. Make a list of prayer requests and pray for them regularly. pray for our country pray for the one who is ruling over our country pray for your family relatives and friends pray for those who are sick spend time with god in prayer as much as possible thank you for listening and be blessed praise the lord